Let's have a look at a work solution to one of the questions from checkpoint test 2. Question 3. Determine the value of x. Okay, so you are given a right angle triangle and the angle that you are given in, within that triangle is 21 degrees. So remember we can label the three sides of the triangle with reference to the 21. The side opposite the right angle is the hypotenuse and the side opposite the angle is the opposite side which means the remaining side is the adjacent side. X and 10 degrees are hypotenuse and adjacent. So hypotenuse and adjacent combine to give you the ratio for cos. So the cos of 21 degrees is the adjacent side over the hypotenuse. If we want to solve for X here, we need to multiply both sides by X. So we get X cos 21 is equal to 10. And now we divide both sides by the cos of 21 in order to get the value for x. If you work out 10 cos 21, 10 divided by cos 21 on your calculator, you will get 10,71. Question 6. A 5 meter tall tree casts a shadow of 12 meters on the ground. Determine the angle of elevation of the sun. So this is a slightly tricky question, but if we just start with our basic idea, the tree will be vertical and it will make a 90 degree angle with the ground, which is horizontal. We know that the tree is 5 meters and it makes a shadow. So we can assume that this distance here is the shadow. And that means that the sun must be somewhere over here. Okay, so the angle of elevation to the sun will be this angle over here that we are trying to find. Okay, so that is the ratio opposite over adjacent, which is the tan. So the tan of x will be equal to the opposite side over the adjacent side. So we do the shift tan of 5 over 12 in order to determine the value of x. And that gives us 22,62 degrees.